these were some of the most heart-stopping moments of 2019 caught on camera. Whoa, these two Maryland teens and their chihuahua were just sitting in the living room watching TV when a tree comes crashing through the roof. But look, did that fridge save their lives? If the refrigerator was not where it was in the kitchen, the girls would have probably been crushed. High winds and stormy weather were to blame for the tree's collapse. Off now to Lake Michigan, where a toddler was almost swept away by a duck floaty. His mom had apparently let go for just a second, but it was just long enough for him to float out of her reach. Luckily, paddleboard instructor David Benjamin tried his hardest to reach the scared child. He starts grabbing the head of the duck. I can see he's, you know, full crying mode, stomping his feet, just terrified. But just in the nick of time, after the ducky flips over, dunking the boy in the water, a boat arrives and pulls the toddler to safety. Look at the kids here. They're oblivious to the fact that their parents might have to make a crash landing. The throttle cable on their single engine plane snapped. The plane was stuck on full power, meaning it was going too fast to land safely. We're gonna declare an emergency. I have no throttle control. Pilot Devin Miller circles a Mississippi airport before reaching a mechanic. If he's in flight, he, he may have to come in for a landing and you turn the engine off. So that's what Devin did. You guys have crash vehicles there on site, you can scramble. We do. But luckily, they didn't need it. And Devin comes in for a safe landing, much to his wife's relief. This hiker in Hawaii caught her own drama on camera. Oh. Heather Friesen's GoPro caught the terrifying moment when she slipped 50 feet down some rocks and into water. You can see in the video there's kind of this little trickle of water that was in the shadows, which I didn't see. I stepped right on it and my right foot came out from under me, so I started falling. She called for help and one of her hiking partners came to her aid. I need somebody down here to help me out. Heather ended up suffering 10 broken ribs, a collapsed lung, and a fractured scapula. Over to Erie County, New York, where what appears to be a robbery you, back right there. turns out to be a marriage proposal. They wrote, let me see a ring. Yeah, we're not married. You know what, what are you waiting for? That's when the fake robber hands Ray Giuliano a ring, and he gets down on one knee. Ray says everyone was in on the gag and that they closed down the store so no one else could walk in and think a real robbery was going down. We notified the police that this was going on. We had a prop gun, it wasn't a real gun, so I mean we tried to do it as, as safe as possible. And how many times have you apologized? 7,293 I believe it is. And finally, this heart stopper. Tiny Pomeranian doesn't make it onto the elevator in time with their owner. The leash is still on and the pup could have been strangled. But thanks to the woman's quick thinking neighbor, the dog was set free. The whole time this is all happening that uh, the girl was inside screaming. As soon as those doors shut, she was screaming and I could hear it the whole time. Uh, it was actually really scary. I mean, I mean, it was scary for me and I'm sure it was scary for her. Now he's being called a hero for his swift action saving humans best friend. For InsideEdition.com, I'm Stephanie Officer.